Hey guys, how are you doing? If iTunes not detecting or not showing iPhone when it is connected to Windows laptop, then you can try this alternative method to fix the problem and you can start managing your iPhone easily. So here a user experienced an issue recently which he shared. When it comes to the iTunes and Windows related problems, you know, it is a never ending scenario. I wish Apple completely discontinues the iTunes just like they did with Mac computers and for Windows, they bring a better, a permanent alternative that lets us to manage the iPhone and iPad easily. So here you can see that the user uh, normally sees the iPhone next to the music, uh, you know, the pull down menu and or under the library music playlist, there'll be devices, which also lets us to manage our connected iPhone to the Windows laptop. We can perform the iOS restore and we can perform the uh, complete clean and slash if the iPhone or iPad, you know, stuck in the boot loop or if we want to erase all the data after taking backup and if we want to fix any uh, software related issues that is not fixed with any troubleshooting steps. So in such cases, we have to use the iTunes software in Windows laptop uh, to manage and, you know, to take a backup to perform the restore and so on. Also, we can manage the media contents like syncing the movies, music and photos, everything through iTunes. It is a little bit looks easier but you know for people who don't want to manage the content automatically they want to sync from a particular folder on their device to the uh, device thing or the iphone or ipad this itunes software provides an easy solution in this case you can see the itunes uh, is not detecting or not showing iphone and in the second screenshot he confirmed that instead of showing it on itunes the iphone is visible in the my computer application so when he opens the my computer he can see the apple iphone and there he is able to navigate inside like a pen drive and access the dcim folder which is the photos application content you can try right click and eject you know in order to remove this from the devices and then check itunes software if it is working or not if you still have problem check your cable that is second important thing if there is any breaks or any damages on the cable either it is a lightning cable if you're using an iphone 14 or earlier model if it is iphone 15 or 16 you know then you obviously use the usb c cable so check whether there is any damage on the cable if the cable is perfectly fine then in the next third troubleshooting step you need to check the try switching the USB port. Sometimes when the device is connected to the USB 2 port, if it is a little bit older Windows laptop, if it has USB 2 port, then the transfer rate and speed, everything will be less at the same time. Some users have experienced this sort of iTunes not detecting or not showing the iPhone or iPad when it is connected. So try switching the USB port, you know, if it is USB A or USB C, you can change the uh, port uh, connecting the cable to different port and check whether it is able to de detect or not. The next fourth one is restart the Windows computer, restart the iPhone and then check whether it is working or not. As the last troubleshooting step, you need to download and install Apple Devices app by navigating to Microsoft App Store and then check Apple Devices app. Okay, search for it and then verify it is from Apple Inc download and install it then you will see all the device management options the connected iphone or ipad will be visible there and you can easily navigate and uh, you know manage your iphone content you can update you can restore you can take a backup of your uh you know the iphone you can also sync the music movies photos content you know everything right from this apple devices app after installing the software if there is any permission related issues try to restart the iphone and your your uh, Windows laptop that will definitely be helpful in case of any software bugs causing you know you are able to see the device but unable to manage the content okay that sort of thing uh, can be fixed with a simple restart and only for photos management if uh, you are unable to do it with the Apple devices app then try to use the photos app that is available in the Windows 11 operating system so that can also be an another alternative which will help uh, you know if you want to manage just the photos and videos and you don't want to use all the other features of Apple devices application so that is all uh, this will help you to fix iTunes not detecting or not showing on your uh, you know Windows laptop and I hope this information helped you the workarounds I have suggested helped you to fix the issue today for more useful iPhone iPad and Mac related tips and tricks don't forget to subscribe thank you so much for for watching have a wonderful day